<laughs> well, I'm taking, and um, the doctor's actually prescribed me some, uh, some, uh, some things to help me, um, sleep, and, um, because, uh, we're going through a really hard time at the moment at home. We. Every, all of us, everyone. Right. All of us, because of, um. Mr. Scruff? The cat. Right. Uh. I don't want to drag everything down. But, you know, if it, you... We're already down there, <laughs> so, I mean... You, you know, a few, like, a, a few weeks ago, I was idly... Idly saying that his balls were bigger than mine. Well, we had to get rid of him. <sighs> his balls, that is, not him. Oh. I have to get rid of his ball. Not oh, okay. my balls. So only a tiny bit. <laughs> Not right. my balls. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> still, balls. only a tiny bit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, um, yesterday, uh, he w went to the vet and had an operation, and they put him to sleep, and they cut him out. To sleep? Yeah. To sleep sleep? To sleep sleep. To forever sleep, like Yoda? No. He's woken up now. Oh. All right. And they removed his testicles and scrotum. Right. Oh, and uh, he's been really hard on all of us. <sighs> yeah, I had a cat who had to uh, get... Fuck your cat! <laughs> this is about my cat. This is serious. Well, this, this is serious, serious. Too. He's, he's... I've had to come in to work... I uh, check with um, HR, Human Resources. I can't get any fucking time off for this. <laughs> <laughs> no fucker cares about my problems. Yeah, because I want to talk about my cat now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your cat's dead. Um, ah, so he's at home on his own. Ah, he's got a... Um, yeah, and you lock him away as well. In a <laughs> tiny little broom closet that he can't... He was like, no, the ground floor. The ground floor is not that small. He... He's... I'm worried, but I'm just so worried... Because he's got a, he's got a cone on his head. A cone. A cone. What do you call it? Yeah, the cone. The cone. Yeah. It's attached to his collar, because he, all he wants to do is lick his ball. <laughs> <laughs> That's all he wants to do. Well, you know, if it were possible for guys to lick their balls all the yeah. time, <laughs> now I'm kind of be licking your balls. Wow, <laughs> we should get some cones made for us. <laughs> no people will think we can lick our balls. <laughs> Do people know what I mean when I say this? It's like a yeah, yeah. It's a cone-shaped thing all around his head. Dogs, yeah, yeah, yeah. But he's because he's, he'll keep the wound open and it will yeah. get infected. So he's got the cone around his head. Ah, oh, he hates it. He hates it. He keeps walking. He's, he's walking backwards a lot of the time. It's humiliating for him because not only has he lost his manhood, right. he's now walking backwards, and the children laugh at him. Right. Are you, are you videoing this for, no for, for future... No, we get, no, no, I'm trying to preserve his dignity. <laughs> oh, man, but the thing is... Uh, I'm worried on so many levels because, you know, it's raining a lot now. He doesn't go outside anyway. Mm, well, he, he can now, you see. Ah, so, so you, you give him a taste of the outside, and then you put a frickin' cone on his head and chop his balls off... <sighs> I had a nightmare, then. <laughs> I had a nightmare. I can't, I've got, this is just taking over my life, I can't take it anymore. He was out, he, he's outside. He's new to him outside, but he's outside, smelling the air, looks right. up at the sky. Yeah. He's like, what's that glowing what's that? bright thing? Yeah. <laughs> the rain starts to fall. <laughs> what's this stuff hitting me? I can't even see it. <laughs> But he looks up into the sky, to the stars, seeing the rain coming down. He gets a crook in his neck. <laughs> he can't look down. The cone begins to fill up with rainwater. <laughs> he drowns. He drowns you in his own cone. You made a waterproof connection around his neck with the cone. Uh, you, it you, sounds like you're laughing at me. Deliberately torturing him. That's what like it sounds you're like. At me. And then when he tries to come in through the cat door, he can't because the cone's too big. He can't get out. No, we let him in. He can't get out the cat door. So I've had ah. to bring a litter tray into the house. Get this. He, uh, last night he did a, a massive cat shit. 
as everyone knows, cat shit's the worst of all the shit. Like, it dog is, shit's bad, everywhere. but cat's worse. Um, oh boy, he does the cat shit in the litter tray. He comes off a litter tray, he turns around to sniff it. <laughs> and as he bends down, he scoops <laughs> a significant amount of the cat shit into the cone. Subscribe to the Digital Porridge podcast at digitalporridge.com.